In this video, we're just going to look at how to install Python and set up a quick Pygame file. So here is Python 3.6.5. I double click on it and I click on Add Python 3.6. You must add this path, otherwise some of the pip stuff doesn't work. Then just do install and then it will set off installing. This might take a little bit of time. So we'll just cut to the bit where it works. OK, so Python is now successfully set up. The important thing now is to type CMD and get a command line up. And then you can type pip install pygame. This will go out onto the internet, pick up pygame and install it straight onto the computer. You'll probably see for mine that the requirement's already satisfied and that should be absolutely fine. Um, if you get this here, upgrading, you might want to type the python minus m pip install hyphen hyphen upgrade. That will upgrade pip and then do the pip install pi game. But I know that mine is working, so I don't need to bother with any of that. Once I've done that, I then need to go to my documents. Here's my pi game. I've got startup all ready to go. Um, I want to open with going to do it with I'm going to look for some apps if I can find idle down there at the moment it doesn't seem to be linked to it so we'll have a look at that in another moment perhaps we can try we'll get to those in a moment but first of all you can obviously just open it with idle there it is and that opens up my startup.py and you can see here's the first line I import the Pi game library then I define some colors, uh, RGB, red, green, blue. Okay, so I've got black, which is naught of everything, white, which is 255 of everything, uh, and blue and yellow are defined. This just initializes pi game. And then I've got a size. The screen then is set to the size. I put a little caption in, which says my window. I set done equals false, because that's going to be a game flag, which we'll see in the next task and then finally I set the clock. I can now run this module. There we are it runs and as you can see there are no errors. My window has appeared and this window is 640 by 480 pixels. We're now ready to see what we can do with Pygame. 